the news station. This is News Watch 16 at 11. It's official. President Obama took the oath of office today to begin his second term as commander in chief. The swearing in is a formality before tomorrow's big inauguration as our top story on News Watch 16 at 11. Good evening. I'm Sophia Ojeda. President Obama took the oath of office for the second and last time. I, Barack Hussein Obama, do solemnly swear. The president had to take the oath before noon today as required in the Constitution. The public swearing in will be tomorrow on the National Mall. The president plans to use the same Bibles once used by President Abraham Lincoln and Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Vice President Joe Biden was also sworn in this morning by Supreme Court Justice Sonia Sotomayor. Live coverage of the inauguration begins tomorrow at noon right here on WNEP. As Washington prepares for tomorrow's inauguration celebration, a new poll released today shows Americans remain divided on how things are going in the country. According to the CNN ORC International Survey, 49% of people say things are going well. That's up six points from November and more than double the 21% asked at the time of the president's first inauguration in 2009. On the flip side, however, that leaves 51% saying things are going badly. To Scranton, where a morning fire at an apartment building forced 90 people out of their homes, many of the residents are elderly or disabled. Newswatch 16's Barry DeWitt has details of the blaze. 